Hey guys, uh, this is another video, and this is on something I call Pimp My Dungeon. And really what happens is I come in, and uh, you find a dungeon, I'll pimp it out and make it a uh, sick home. So let's go down down to uh, Pimp My Dungeon territory. Um, this is the first Pimp My Dungeon episode, and pretty much it's like all different kind of pimps, pimps of dungeons. And... I saw a dungeon, I'm like, hey, let's just live in a dungeon like a hermit, you know? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah. So I call it kind of like a miner's dungeon, a miner's kind of like living how a miner lives. So someone that mines down in the mines all day in Minecraft, they live in a dungeon. I feel like that should be their house. So this is kind of an example of a miner's house slash a pimp my dungeon. So you come down these little steps, nice little house. Oh, so nice. It's like a wood house underground. So, you come in and pretty much, yeah, you know it. So, if you see my first video, oh, geez. Uh, there's a miner at work. There's a miner at work right now. We can it's, we can see the natural atmosphere. No, just kidding. Um, if you see my first video, this is like the Obsidian Redstone 4 that I've had in there. I just wanted to repeat it again because I, I love the 4 and I haven't used it in so long that I'm like... Let's just use this again because it's a pimp my uh, dungeon. So this is this was all a natural dungeon. I didn't make this obviously because there's the middle thing in there, and uh, these little glowstone uh, wood, dark wood pillars, nice, nice, and then obviously the redstone torches to power the redstone all, all throughout the door. Um, I took all that out because because obviously that's what I usually would do if you get in a dungeon and. Here's the spawning thing, and I don't want to break it because that's kind of like the centerpiece of the Pimp My Dungeon. I'm pretty sure that no zombies or mobs will spawn, but uh, actually I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. So then, the little miner's room. They use their memorabilia slash uh, what they get during their mines or mining adventures uh, to their advantage in their homes. And they can build whatever they want. So that what they do is uh, gl gold and and a little triangular pattern, nice, nice. And then a golden floor. It's not excess because I found all these materials, no duplication, just a nice miners kind of thing. And then obviously a uh, lapis azul little entrance and two nice little beds. And you can add a third one if you want to just have one big, big bed and it'd be so sick. And then convenience uh, number A is having a mine right next to their house. Yeah, so this is a mine right next to their house, and pretty much it just goes down all the way to lava, and yeah, and there's some more some, some more mining, and so I just want to show you that. I thought it was really cool, and um, yeah, so as I said, I thought it was pretty, uh, pretty awesome, um, Pin My Dungeon. Hopefully, uh, I'll come out with some more Pin My Dungeons, and hopefully they'll be, uh, guys, okay, first of all, as I tell you all the time, comment on the bot below. Tell me what you think about my episodes. Tell me, tell me the truth. Tell me this is a little bit boring compared to your other ones. This is a little, uh, this is a little, um, this is nice. I like it. You should keep going with your Pimp Your Dungeon episodes. But if you don't like it, just say, oh, well, I kind of prefer this or that. Or you can say, oh, uh, Puzzle Dine saying, Matt Mojo, this, this sucks. But don't, don't be like, I mean, d you don't have to be like that. Okay, well. So this has been my dungeon episode one. Hopefully next time I find a dungeon, put my dungeon episode two. And it'll be a complete different mo remodel of a dungeon. Complete different stuff. Um, yeah, so pretty much complete different stuff. It'd just be so cool to see all the dungeons that I keep popping out with. Because it's such a main, like, it's such a main icon in Minecraft that it's just, it's great to have kind of the different kind of uh, ways you can decorate and as you can see hopefully in these dungeons you'll see different t decorating uh te techniques and yeah so hopefully hopefully you enjoy thanks guys